Hi, my name is Maggie McCall and I am in Miranda's room as she is unwinding and relaxing and performing her favorite hobby, which is painting. I really like to read or paint, which I'm not very good at painting, but I enjoy it. It's very peaceful and just kind of lets me calm down and let my mind wander. Um, those are the two main hobbies I have. Well, my mom has been, I mean, she's not, she just does it for fun too, but I grew up watching my mom like doodle and draw. Um, and there used to be a ceramic store in Scotts Bluff where kind of like paint yourself silly downtown. Um, and so I would go there, I mean, during the summer, I went there probably a couple times a week. Okay, that's probably exaggerating, but I went there a lot. And so I painted a lot of stuff. And I mean, it's a different kind of painting, but so I've always grown up just loving arts and crafts and stuff. And then this summer, um, well, actually the past couple of summers to entertain myself, I sit and I paint and I've bought canvases and I've really kind of invested in some art supplies um, just so that I have them around if I ever feel like painting. Through the use of different kinds of paint, Miranda is able to achieve her desired outcomes. Yeah, I, usually I get my inspiration probably from books or things that I read, um, or even song lyrics. I'm very, I'm very much a lyrical person. Like I love music and stuff, but I really get caught in the lyrics and stuff. So that's usually where I find my inspiration for a lot of my paintings. <laughs> oh yeah, I totally cheat and use the internet. I use <laughs> Pinterest, and I use, um, I like to freehand things, so I don't usually like print stuff out and stencil them, but I do use the internet. Like, I did a painting of a, um, an old, um, once again, words escape me, a record player and stuff. And I used, I used the internet to help me with the um, background of that. As for her future projects? Um, future projects, ooh, I don't know. I really like, um, I really enjoy kind of making things for other people, um, especially when the ceramic store was still open for like wedding presents. I gave um, I gave quite a few wedding presents where I would paint like a plate or a plaque, and I would write and I would do you know usually I would use their wedding colors and I would then write their last name and say established and you know I'd make it all fancy mm -hmm. and pretty or whatever and I really enjoy that and I actually have a lot of friends that are going to be getting married soon so I suppose I could do something for that but I really like painting for other people so I don't have a specific project in mind but maybe for upcoming wedding, wedding presents.